What's up guys, Atom Bacon here, welcome back to more Metroid Prime. In the last episode, we got 11 out of 12 artifacts, well we didn't get all 11 of them, but we got the 11th artifact, and also got the Ice Spreader. And in this episode, I believe we're going for the 12th artifact? This episode, we're finally going to do something, <laughs> other than backtrack and get items. Alright, you heard it here first. Technically, I heard it first, because I heard it before they got uploaded. Congratulations. Oh. Are we not taking the transport before? Maybe we haven't. No, I'm sure I have. I've shown this. <sighs> this is going to be the last backtracky item before we actually get into things. Please die. You're annoying. It looks more like crystal than ice when you freeze those guys. I mean, it's cool. Kind of dory. Right, here's a good door. What's the name of this one? Great Tree Chamber. Okay. So these chambers are just named after trees. Sometimes they have cool names, I don't know. I mean, you gotta give them credit for naming every chamber you can exactly. Like, Extremely original, everyone. That reminds me, I'm not sure if I'm actually going to give each episode a title name for this one. Why? I don't know, it's just. It's not that hard. <laughs> I'm sure you can find something in each episode to name them. Yeah, probably. Intense radiation. Like, we didn't already know that, though. I mean, there were a couple of episodes where I had particular ideas, but that's like maybe two episodes where I thought, oh hey, I have a good idea for an episode name, and one of them I don't even remember what it is. So, don't be lazy. Like I said, I still have quite a while until I upload this. I'm gonna rush through things, we've been backtracking a lot, so no need to kill random enemies really. Speaking of, this isn't really backtracking, but on our way there. <laughs> More missiles. Wonder if I killed all those enemies. That'd be really nice. 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 <laughs> um. Oh no, I do want to go in here. Yeah. Wave trooper. You dead? Nope. What? <laughs> my wave beam. My my arc. Went off him. I just assumed he died. <laughs> but he just like went into static shock. Oh, that one died. <laughs> Good boy. <laughs> That's actually pretty cool, though. The Wave Buster. Yep. Can use it for this too. If I want to. It becomes a waste of missiles after a while. Though. Stop hitting me. They're yeah. just ice troop. <laughs> there they are. You just are. scanned that thing before. I already did. Okay, good. Ice spreader is really unnecessary for these things, honestly. Yeah. Is there something like that for the plasma beam? Yeah. Actually, we're getting that right now. Oh, perfect. Okay, come on, you're trolling me so hard. <laughs> Thank you. One more, maybe? Yep. Our favorite element, Bendesium. I 
as you become a researcher, and for those UU elements at the end of the periodic table, you know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. I'm going to name one of them Bendesium. <laughs> Maybe Cordite, too. I'm surprised it takes up that long to name an element, like, oh. kind of yeah. unnecessary. Yeah. <laughs> like, just think of a name and just throw it out there. The most useless of the missile expansions on the weapons, I don't know what they're called. Add-ons. <laughs> Upgrades. Not really an upgrade. Flamethrower! Flame oh boy. This yeah. one does not need a target. Sweet. Yeah, it looks cool, but it's pretty useless. <laughs> yeah, not to mention it eats through your missile holes really quickly. Yeah. Like, you're down to 82 missiles. Then I started wave bustering and flamethrowering. Yeah. Easy. Just keep composure. <laughs> <laughs> Just gotta time it right. <laughs> Thought there'd be something in here, but I guess not. This room should be inhabited by Metroids by now. Oh, okay. So it does just stay the way I have it. I don't actually need to go to the top, I need to go to the second level, but I'll just jump down. <laughs> Deeper. We're almost there, guys, I swear. <laughs> I know I said we'd be getting some progress in this episode. Even though know, all the episodes have been filled with progress, just not the most entertaining progress. Get my little sniper clan. Have that guy fall dead out of the ceiling. <laughs> I like that one. Okay, let me look at the map here real quick. So this goes here. I don't want to go there. <laughs> Which area are you in? Like, oh, major area? Phase on mines. Ah. I mean, we've been in this in these rooms before, if you remember. Yeah, I, they they look familiar now. I just can't remember. But we're almost the new stuff. Yeah, there definitely seem to be a lot that we haven't been in this area yet. There's still enemies in here. Jesus. 
Homing. <laughs> I don't really want to fight this. I don't want to waste missiles on them. My missiles are going to become valuable. And of course it's ice. I don't know why every door. Please! Why'd you reset? No! Okay. Are you gonna fight me now? Thank you! <laughs> it's about time! <laughs> Maybe this beam doesn't damage that much. Alright. Oh, now he's finishing. Oh, damage him a lot. <laughs> Actually, this might be the only instance in the game where the ice spreader is actually useful. Let's try this out. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Was that a missile drop there, or...? Where? Right. I probably already picked it up. Station, where are you? If it's what I think it is, it's pretty far away, honestly. Okay, our first new room in a while. Well, completely new, I should say. You know what? There's an easy way to do this. Go for the morph ball. <laughs> This is the cutscene I was talking about earlier. You still get to see it, so I mean, it just makes a lot more sense if you see it when you're supposed to. Oh, maybe it doesn't reveal as much as I thought it did, but. Oh, Jesus. You're beautiful. Definitely did not scare me. <laughs> I was expecting a space pirate to come up those stairs and then a Metroid just... Come out of nowhere. Really? No pirate data? Trust you on that. I don't really believe it. Most of the Metroid seem to drop missile pickups more often. Some enemies have higher drop rates than others. What? Where are you? I can't see. I don't want them to hit me. I understand. Metroids are annoying. They get off your head. What's the best thing to do if a Metroid does hit, get you? It's been a while, but if memory serves me right, go into Morph Ball and just bomb. Bomb as much as you can. There's a cool ghetto you can do here. <laughs> oh, 
demonstrate it once, but I'm not going to do it because I already got the missile expansion. When you're speedrunning, instead of using two power, power bombs here, because the other power bomb is pretty um, valuable in terms of saving time, but you ghetto off this up to here, and then you jump across the same way I just did, except going the other direction. That's pretty cool. If you're interested in ghetto jumps, you can just look that up on the internet. I don't really feel a need to explain them in a let's play. Yeah. It's like, if you're someone who would need to use them, you probably know what they are already. Oh, is that a plasma shooter? Oh, no, that's a door. Okay. Moving on. I really thought there was... Now there's a power up in that room. There might be. Once again, I'll find out later. When I'm about to go into the impact crater and be like, I'm missing a missile expansion, really? For Rizzles? Who's down there? Is that just like a basic space pirate? Or, or? Yeah. Eh, gimme! Stop hurting me. Ah, there's a new enemy. Hunter Metroid. Don't know exactly what they're weak to. Stop it. But going by lore and past experience, they're probably weak to ice. Even though my choice of weapon is plasma that's funny. You're actually a bit closer to the comfort. <laughs> Those Metroids like to grapple you and pull you in, even though when it's been trying to, it's actually just been pulling itself closer to me. I'm pretty sure they do actually pull you in, though. Are you supposed to get through that? Oh. Ah. You don't want to go down there. <laughs> yeah. Fortunately, about this area, it gets darker. No, stop. Ah. talking about a second ago. Missile expansion. Don't know if I mentioned it was missile expansion, but... I can't remember if you did or not. Doesn't really matter. The 
meter doesn't even give you any pre-warning before you go near that. It's as soon as you touch it. Warning. <laughs> yeah, really? This looks so cool with the thermal visor. Oh my god. Oh, hi. Second and only in the game. Oh, missile tank. Nice. Or, missile, uh, destruction thing. I can't remember what it's called. Missile station. Oh. <laughs> are, you, are you getting tired? Me? Uh, oh, tiny bit. Ugh. Oh. Darker than I wanted it to be. Oh my god. Yeah, the fire is not sure. Really? I overshot it? Wow. I'm good. <laughs> You're gonna just like, ghetto off this. Hey, cool, I can. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I can make that in one shot, but... I can definitely make that in one shot. I might overshoot it again. Fuck. <laughs> it went and then slid off. That meter is just so insulting. This is a weird room. What the hell? The bomb boos are invisible. <laughs> they don't have their own scan either, they're just invisible bomb boos for some reason. That's a little strange. Have I scanned these yet? Nope. This might be the first instance of me seeing them. I don't actually remember if I Plasma Troopers? Yeah, you haven't encountered those yet. I wouldn't remember those. Are they shooting at me? No way I triggered them from way over there. And even if I did, they wouldn't be shooting at nothing. <laughs> I guess they would, because they are, but... <laughs> oh, wow. 23 minutes in already. Yep. My brain's starting to go a bit fuzzy on this part of the game. I really am having a hard time remembering where missile expansions are. I would believe three more missile expansions to go. I think so, yeah. Because last time you refilled, you were at 235. Yeah, so I need three more missile expansions. Next episode, we're going to kick it off with a lot of action. And explore this new area a bit more.
till next time guys